H55. This particular camera has a bad LCD. We already purchased the LCD from um, from eCrater at Camera Parts for you. Got a pretty good deal on it. Okay, let's go ahead and start the disassembly. On the right side, we got two screws we're going to remove. Okay, then on the bottom, we have three screws we need to remove. Okay, on the, on the uh, other side we have a little side panel, we're just going to pull it down and then remove it and then we have two screws here underneath we need to remove. Okay, we got all the external screws removed. We're going to go ahead and remove this back plate here, this bottom plate. Okay. Now we're going to remove the back cover. We're going to open the door here and start prying off this back cover here. Just carefully remove it. That exposes the the LCD. The uh, option panel here we're going to just flip it up and out of the way for now. Okay now we're going to move the LCD and the back plate assembly. You're going to need to carefully pry off this plate here like this and then just kind of open it up here. And there's a uh, ZIF cable clamp. We're going to flip that up and remove the LCD. At this point you can replace your LCD with the new one just by removing it off of this back plate. But we're going to go ahead and fully disassemble this camera. First thing you notice is the two screws here. Copper looking screws. We're going to remove those. Next we're going to remove the plastic cable holder. First we need to release these um, wires, move them out the way. And then just pop the plastic part off. Okay, next we're going to flip up all the ZIF cable clamps. We got one here, one underneath here, and two here. So let's go ahead and flip these up. There's one screw that holds the flash assembly in place. We're going to go ahead and remove that. That's a different screw, so we're going to set this aside. Okay. Let's go ahead and remove the cables from the clamps. Our next step is to remove the zoom flash assembly. We're going to slightly pry off the. F We're going to slightly pry off here and pull it up and remove that. Our next step is to remove the system board. We're just going to flip it up here.
pinch on the cable and remove the board. By the way, you can pretty much purchase all these parts on eCrater. They have a pretty good website. We deal a lot with camera parts for you. They have a lot of uh, affordable parts that you can purchase online. So anyway, our next step is to move this plastic frame. In order to do that, we need to open the door. This is the plastic frame we need to remove. It's got a clamp here. We're going to just flip that up. And then just remove it. Unsnap it. There we go. Next step is to remove this screw here that holds the flash card assembly in place. Take. And you can remove the flash card. Our next step is to remove the plastic frame here. In order to do that, you have to open the door, grip this part. You need to release this here and then it just pretty much snaps out there's one more clamp here that you got to release and then it snaps right out and you remove that part you remove the uh, tripod base and then you can remove the lens Okay, if you need to remove the door, you can see there's a pin here. You actually have to push that pin all the way through. In order to do that, you got to remove slightly, uh, remove a little bit of this front cover. So you just grab onto this middle ridge, pull it up, just like so, and you push the pin through. 